Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to multiply two numbers with the JavaScript. Uh, we can also multiply one number by another. JavaScript uses the, I call it a star symbol. It's like if you pressed shift and then eight, number eight, uh, that's the symbol for multiplication of two numbers. Uh, so for example, 13 times 13 is 169. Uh, we want to change the zero so that it will pr produce, or so that the product will be equal to 80. So eight times what is 80? 10, right? So you put a one right there, and then you run the test. Now, you see, I think that's useful, but at the same time, um, I think that it's important for us to like think about this in another way. You can do, uh, if you go to the, your terminal and you've got node set up, you can go to node, and then you can be like uh, 10 uh, times uh, 10. That'll give you 100, right? You could do 100 times uh, 0.17, and you get 17. So this is sort of the way that uh, JavaScript utilizes um, uh, just sort of just basic math. So this multiplication thing is does that. If you don't know how to get Node, you should learn how to do that because this uh, this is called a REPL, and so um, you can utilize this as a tool to sort of test your code. Um, so you just open up, you press Command Spacebar, and then you press Terminal. The terminal will open up here, and you can press node, and then you can go like two times two, and you'll get four. Uh, three times three will get you uh, nine, right? You could also do something tricky. This is something in the future. Three times three is equal to nine, and this should render as true. Ah, cool. So this is something different in the future. But I hope you get. I hope that this gives you an idea for how to use the multiplication tables in JavaScript. Thank you for watching. Um, oh, should we run the tests? Yes, it appears we've got it right. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video.